So I want to give you a little more information about what the spring equinox soul journey to self-trust is about. First of all, it's for leaders, for creators, for social justice advocates, for healers and feelers who are rooted in love, who stand for justice, and who have something important that they want to bring into the world, spread in the world. So it could be a vision, it could be uh, a business, it could be a podcast, an album, a, an art, but it's something that you want to bring from below ground, above ground, which is what spring allows us to do. So what this soul journey does is it helps to create the soil the positive, the rich soil that you'll need that surrounds that idea. And by soil, I mean your own mindset. I mean your body. I mean the energy that you have in which you're holding this idea. Because one of the things I've noticed is that uh, beautiful people with incredible, very, very, very needed um, ideas, art, uh, projects, initiatives get tripped up by self-doubt, self-criticism, double, double guessing, triple, tri <laughs> triple changing their minds, just basically being in a soup of negativity inside of them. So much inner resistance to bringing forth this idea that they can't do it, or if they do get it above ground, they can't sustain it because there's so much inside of them that is fighting against them. And that's not strategy. That has to do with soil work. That is why we have a soul journey to self-trust so that you can do work at the soil level to build up a capacity to trust yourself. So in this spring equinox soul journey to self-trust, that's what we're going to work on. So if you're someone who has a gift, who has a dream, who wants to um, expand into your intergalactic, limitless self, I invite you to take the soul journey to self-trust with us. I wanted to tell you a little bit about the structure. So we meet on Saturday, March the 16th, through Tuesday, March the 19th. We meet for about an hour to an hour and a half each day. Um, and during that time, I share some teachings on regenerating with the earth, some principles that we'll need, and then practices. We actually practice um, um, ways to tap into the parts of us that are self-critical, that are sabotaging, that are fearful, that feel overwhelmed, that feel abandoned, <laughs> that do not want to go for it. We tap into those parts as well as into the parts of you that feel joyful, expansive, and that want to um, propagate your idea. So we, in this container, help you to touch into those parts and to work with those parts of you in such a way where they um, become neutralized, where they have more ease with you going forward. And how we do it, how we, how we work with these different parts of you, are uh, you learn with us, but you can also practice it on your own after the soul journey, should that, uh, you know, that freak out, that internal <laughs> sabotaging, Thing reemerge, you know where to go for it. But we also, in this soul journey, are going to be focusing on being um, how to care for yourself, how to rest, how to regenerate, give your body and your energy system what it needs. When I think of soul journeying to self-trust, I am thinking of the group of us together 
and individually journeying to a place where the our our insides become like rich fertile soil just so happy to nourish that idea that project uh that yearning you know um so that it can come forth into the spring so my intention is that we will regenerate with the earth so that you can be your unlimited authentic self release any of these internalized supremacy culture ideas that are keeping you at war with yourself and having joy along the way touching into joy along the way that is your birthright so even though it's only four days and it is you know an hour to an hour and a half each day as a collective we will expand time so that you feel deeply nourished rested and connected to an energy source that is larger than just your single body and so that energy source is the earth but it's also to your beloved ancestors or to the cosmos or to god or to goddesses whatever is real for you we're going to make sure that you get connected to that larger energy source and finally that you emerge with a clear focus for at least one next step that you can take to bring that project idea dream um into a reality. I hope you'll join us. All you have to do is go to my page, dramandakemp.com forward slash spring dash equinox to sign up.